John Toretto loves the concept of fun in the Fast and the Furious. A plethora of obstacles set forth to separate the fun, and they are all nefarious. The fun, as a unit, overcomes all of the seriousness until they are victorious. Some of it super precarious, most of it over the top hilarious. Because <laughs> you know full well that the stunts performed in the film could never really be done in real life, right? The point of the films, to me, has always been if we stick together as a we can overcome anything that satisfies the devil's appetite. Anything set upon us to ignite, incite, gaslight, an unnecessary fight will perish because no weapon formed against me shall prosper used as my torchlight. My searchlight in the darkness of my confusion to their betrayal. Love, loyalty, devotion, caring, understanding, patience, being their portrayal. Kinfolk should always be in fellowship, strengthening their partnership, creating an overabundance of God-level love warship, filled with all the ammo needed to defeat any and all evil battleships formed, to strike against all atrocities sent your way, whether performed or merely brainstormed. What's the saying? Stay ready so you don't have to get ready. Wow, what a shame. The family portrait frame should not be encased in this bullshit with the people who bear the same last name by marriage or blood. Yet these are the first humans to drag your reputation through the mud, planting seeds in their own brain, hearts, and others growing like weeds. Pull out the prayer beads. <laughs> Fade out, you know what I mean? This type of behavior by those closest to you is more common than you think. Cause you to rethink how close you let future people in for the love hoodwink. With the lies they set up lip sync. Fuck out of here, you stink. I ain't going around round with you like a roller rate planted on a hockey ring. Loyalty is slippery as just spilled juice on the counter strike, you know what I mean?